Thank you for inviting me to participate in the Global Inaugural Colorectal Cancer Congress. My name is Kim Newcomer, and I'm the manager of the Never Too Young Program and the Never Too Young Advisory Board. I'm also a certified patient and family support navigator and an 11 and a half year survivor of stage four rectal cancer. We know the incident rates of young onset colorectal cancer is rising. So the Alliance created the Never Too Young Advisory Board. Now the board is made up of 40 patients, survivors and caregivers whose lives have been affected by young onset colorectal cancer. The Never Too Young Board pursues local and national efforts to raise awareness about young onset colorectal cancer and remove its stigma. The Colorectal Cancer Alliance is the world's largest nonprofit colorectal cancer patient advocacy organization dedicated to funding colorectal cancer research. Our research program is a critical driving force in our mission to end colorectal cancer in our lifetime. Since 2016, the Alliance has funded nearly 3 million in cutting edge, innovative and life-saving research. In 2018 and 2019, we funded five new and innovative research projects to study young onset colorectal cancer, rectal cancer, and colorectal cancer prevention. In 2020, we're committed to funding an additional 1.1 million to support individual scientists through competitive, peer-reviewed research grants. This year, the Colorectal Cancer Alliance funding will focus on translational research that will impact young onset colorectal cancer and health disparities. Every year, the Alliance surveys the young onset colorectal cancer community to learn more about their experience, diagnosis, and quality of life with the intent of learning about and tracking the medical and psychosocial experiences of this often overlooked group, which comprises 11% of colorectal cancer patients today. In 2018, we reached almost 1,200 patients in 38 countries in one month. We had earned media from major news outlets, including CNN Health, NBC News, and over 100 citations in both medical and lay journals. We published five abstracts. In 2019, we obtained IRB approval and expanded our survey to include lifestyle habits prior to diagnosis and compared the reported unmet needs among patients and survivor groups based on the type of cancer, gender, education, type of residency, and stage of diagnosis. We also partnered with other or CRC organizations to help disseminate our survey. In 2019, we had almost 1,100 responses, and we are about to publish 11 different abstracts. Our Never Chiang survey report will be published in June of 2020. In 2018, the Colorectal Cancer Alliance launched a survey for caregivers of young onset colorectal cancer patients. Caregivers are an important part of the patient journey. They often help with activities of daily living and serve as liaisons with the medical community and the patient's social network. The goal of this survey was to cast light on and explore the experience and challenges of caregivers who are caring for young onset colorectal cancer patients. Our caregiver report will be out in June of 2020. So what has our Never Too Young board been up to? The Never Too Young has had several campaigns. Our first and one of our most successful is Operation Blue Boxes. The Never Too Young Advisory Board implemented a national on-air media campaign to raise awareness for colorectal cancer and the Alliance by mailing blue boxes to local and major markets, stations. The blue box contained a floral pin and a request to wear it on Dress and Blue Day, along with key media-friendly resources and information about the Alliance. So what was our impact? In 2019, we reached 37 anchors across the country. We had 17 on-air interviews, two radio interviews, and two podcasts. In 2020, we changed our ask. We asked them to um, do a segment on colorectal cancer during the any time during the month of March. And we were able to reach 72 anchors who ran segments on colorectal cancer and wore our pen. We had 29 on-air interviews, four radio interviews, two podcasts, and six publications. And because March 
was cut short with COVID-19, be, it would be difficult to see what our true impact would be if we were able to um, have the entire month of March. So we're looking forward to 2021 to see what our impact will be. The Never Chiang Board also created a colorectal cancer awareness video that was highlighted at the colorectal cancer um, early age onset CRC summit in 2019. It had testimonials highlighting patients, survivors, and caregivers, and it was created by the Never Chiang Advisory Board. And we launched it in April after the, the summit, and we reached 16,000 people on Facebook. The video is on the next slide. Please feel free to watch. It is completely amazing. Our next campaign was Living Legacy. Living Legacy helped us raise awareness and funds for young onset colorectal cancer in the month of June. We created six one minute trailers featuring survivors, patients and caregivers, six longer films for the participants to share with their loved ones, and a three minute trailer we split into two for social media. We also had a personal behind the scenes film made by the filmmaker who was also a colorectal cancer survivor. We had amazing impact in the month of June. We had over 500,000 in reach, 50,000 views, and 3,300 impressions. And it just keeps growing as it goes. We also had lots of Facebook engagement for just a three minute trailer. Here is the video on the next slide. Please feel free to take uh, a look at these amazing um, stories. And this is the beautiful Diana Sloan. So we had so much interest in our Never Too Young Advisory Board. We couldn't have 200 people on our board, so we created the Never Too Young Young Allies Volunteer Program. And these are volunteer roles for people who want to spread awareness for young onset colorectal cancer. You can see the social media tiles are in front of you right now, and our armchair advocates use these tiles to promote our Never Too Young survey. We also provide a social media calendar and daily post and social media tiles for our volunteers to post daily on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Pinterest. You, they're able to use the power of social media to advocate on behalf of young onset colorectal cancer patients, survivors, and caregivers, all with the click of a mouse. We also have a peer-to-peer -peer role to provide support through our online communities and our buddy program. They can share their own experiences with having or caring for someone with young onset colorectal cancer in our daily or weekly chats. We have our Never Too Young events where they can make partnerships and be a representative of Never Too Young at an event in their, in their own town. And we have our Never Too Young speakers. Our speakers raise awareness and support um, for our work through speaking in their local communities about the issues faced by young onset colorectal cancer and what the Alliance and Never Too Young are doing to help. They also created our stay at home video. Um, our committee members wanted people to stay home. They were worried about people not paying attention um, to, to COVID-19. So they made this amazing video that had amazing impact. They reached 9,606 people in just three days, over a thousand engagement, um, all organic reach in three days. It's pretty amazing. You can watch the video here. We also have a volunteer training session um, available for our allies for community events, our buddy program. We have a filmmaking 101 um, training session, uh, storytelling, and um, our Operation Blue Box campaign. We also have training sessions available for DIY fundraising. Our Never Too Young board also created these amazing tributes to Peg and, and Valerie Schlosser. Um, so please take a look at those uh, amazing. Our, our Never Too Young board um, is like, all the members are like family. Um, they all love each other very dearly, dearly and we all know what a tight-knit tight community we have. So they all have such powerful voices. 
here are some resources that are available on our website. Um, you can go to go.ccalliance.org slash downloads. And we also have our Young Onset Colorectal Cancer Brief. We call it our Hero Provider. It's a brief on young onset colorectal cancer trends, the symptoms, the risk factors, the do's, and the available tests. Um, we also have, um, we are also asking people to be our hero. So if they have a colleague who's helped a patient with prevention or early detection to let us know, and our patient survivors and caregivers um, can also nominate a hero provider. So we're trying to get um, are everyone involved to, to raise awareness and um, have early detection for colorectal cancer. So what can you do to help? You can join Never Too Young. We would like to have you help us pursue local and national efforts to educate young people and medical providers about this disease. Um, so please contact me at knewcomer at ccalliance.org if you'd like more information or if you'd like to get involved. You can also connect with us at ccalliance.org, on our helpline, on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Thank you so much for allowing me to be here, um, and thank you.